Hello people, welcome back to our channel where you are going to learn English for free. Where I'm going to teach you English for free. We are here to serve you, to teach you English. So far, we've, we've taught different students and our students have, have got the best level. That's why we sensitize you or mobilize you to come and learn with us. English language, which is very better. Standard English. We are teaching standard English to Rwandans, Burundians, and any other person from any other country. We are here to serve you. I am Teacher Jasper. We are going to start. But before starting, I'm going to give you some announcement. The first announcement is this one. People who want us to advertise their products, if you want us to advertise your products, we are here to help you, to serve you. We want to stretch out what you are doing. We, we want to spread wherever in the world wide what you are doing. That's why we are here. Then contact us or try your best to SMS us or inbox us so that we can help you to advertise your product or to advertise your product. Good. The second announcement is this one. If you are there and you don't have books of tenses, niba udafte ibitabo ja tenses, mubyukuri wachitsuko, cyo gereza gishobora kuzakugora. Dufite two different books of tenses. Dufite one book of tenses, uh igitabo kimwe kifite ama page menshi agera kuri 300 cha tenses. Kuva kuri simple present kugera kuri future perfect continuous. Icyo gitabo kiri kugura ibumbi bibiri gusa. And we have another book which is related to regular and irregular verbs. Chindi jitawa chijanya na regular and irregular verbs. Murabi ziko izo regular na irregular verbs yutazizi utaminya gukora za ama perfect, present perfect, past perfect, future perfect, future perfect continuous. We are there to serve you, to give you that book. Kumafranga ijiumbigus. List of regular and irregular verbs. Muchinyar gwanda, icho njereza, niji faraz. Good. Then, Hari cyo navuze ariko sinakivuga mu kinyarwanda wowe ushaka ko tukwamamariza ko tugeza kuri bicuruzwa byawe ibyo ukora try to contact us try to sms us or inbox us udusange muri muri whatsapp twandikire cyangwa duhamagare cyangwa twandikire utwohereza ubutumwa bugufi thank you very much for your attention murakoze kuba mwanteza amatwi then this is the right time for you to learn how to pronounce different words here I have five words. I have five words that many people use to mispronounce. Many people, especially even my students, my students use to, mis to, mispronounce, to mispronounce these words. The first word is this one. The second is this one. The third word is this one. And the fourth one, fourth one is this one. And the last one is this one. Then before teaching you how to use this word, here I have a student. My student is going to read these five words. Aje kudusomeru mwenye shuri. My student is going to, to read. No, no, nyuma yo gusoma. Turaza kureba ese. Has he done it very nicely? Ese ya viko zeneza. Or there is some gap. Just he has, he has met some barriers. Changwa ya huye ni bibazo bitando kani. Some challenges in terms of reading. Good. I'm going to welcome uh, my student. Uh, Yes, welcome my student. You are going to read the first word which is here. How can you read it with the highest voice? Try to speak louder. Realize. Re? Realize. 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 Uh -huh. Organize. Organize. Okay, that's fine. Realize. Okay. He's saying realize. The second, organize. Uh -huh. The third, coronize. Co? Coronize. Yes, coronize with ra. Coronize, coronize. The fourth one? Economize. Economize. Economize with, with A. Economize. Good. The, the fifth one? The, the fifth? Fifth is? Finalize. Finalize. Good. Finalize. Very nice. Yeah, the student has tried his best. Yeah, but it is not pronounced. Yeah, what he has said, just it is, or just it is on his level. But here we don't say realize, we say realize. But most of people used to say realize. 
aka kana watu realize changwa realize we say realize realize because it it take ko rahanga when we have z e yo tutaka uyu mujemu this ending uyu musozo uyu musozo z e when you have z z e here with two bar three syllables to bar meje mitatu then mujemu wa gatatu tugashiraho stress syllables ni byo twita imijemu mu cyongereza good then we count one syllable this is one syllable this is the second yeah lie lie year and this is the third then we say rear you know you know mujemu we had je nubwo bonari a here here we say realize realize then this is the first uh, the first syllable the second syllable the third syllable then we put the, the we put the stress here realize re re now go to go realize ah uh, uh, i realize that no i realize that kugeza ubu ntuzongera kuvuga ngo i realize no i realize realize good then after here we are going to see the second one to realize means uh, first of all the definition of realize is this one to become aware of something gutahura kumenya ikintu runakutaruza for example ushobora kuvuga kuti i didn't realize that mary had been pregnant that time ntabwo nigeze kumenya ko maria yaratwite cyaje okay or you can say she didn't realize that i had come to visit him ntabwo yigeze mu byukuri amenya ko nagiye kumusura that is to realize good then the second one is organize because tujye kubara nubundi umujemo wa mbere one syllable the second syllable the third syllable which is here then we put the stress here stress to ishira hariya isaku turaishira tuvuge organize don't say organize as my student has said munyeshuru wanje yavuze ngo organize igirana bijivugwa we don't pronounce it it is silent then we say organize to organize we don't say to organize never we say to organize verb is verb is to organize good then to organize is to do what to arrange in working order kushira ibintu ku murongo that is to organize for example you can say i'm going to organize this meeting don't say i'm going to organize no it's not standard english people can hear you can understand what you're saying but it's not a very standard english it is somehow awkward when you say uh, to, to organize you say organize ubyish cyangwa organize no to organize i'm going to organize the meeting ngiye gutegura ina they are organizing different different events bari gutegura ibirori bitandukanye or different parties we don't say events hano ko tunavuga events mu cyongera tuvuga events ntabwo nico cyongereza event eh yeah that that, that event was very nice cyakiro cyari kimeze neza cyangwa se bya birori cyangwa se cyagikorwa twakoze event no don't say event ne good tuzabireba na then we are coming here to the the to the third one which is colonize umunye shuri wange yavuze colonize since ukuntu yabivuze ariko hari hari mwaka mukatameze neza colonize here we say colonize then the stress is here we are going to count one umujemo wa mbere the second umujemo wa kabiri the third the third syllable umujemo wa gatatu bita dushiraho stress aka kanu niko kagaragaza stress this one Col- we say colonize to colonize don't say to colonize Mm-mm. no because it itaje ko ritari kugoga ntabwo avuga to colonize we say colonize eh huh? for example you can say africa was colonized by europeans africa was colonized by europeans africa ya ya koronejwe naba 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 nyaburaje cyangwa se naba koroni biburaje then here when you say to colonize means to intrude into and take and take over and or lead nukwinjira ahantu ucengera ukinjira mu bantu warangiza ugatakinga over ukabayobora that is to colonize colonize my friend don't say to colonize i'm giving you different examples for example you can say uh, uh, america or united states of america was colonized by 
British or England bango America ya colonizwe na 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 bongereza nuzabwe ngo was colonized no we say colonized as here we put the stress here my friend colonized don't say colonized colonized no colonized good the fourth one the fourth one is this one to economize eh munyeshuri wange yavuze economize sizu kunya bisomya ariko ya ariko yagerageje He's a very good student. Yeah, when you me, a good. But here we don't say to economize. Economize, no. To have a stress. One, umujemo wa bere, umujemo wa kaviri, umujemo wa gatatu. Now we don't forget about economize. No, we put the stress here. To have a hand, to forget e economize. To economize. Try to economize what you are having. Jira jesa to economize. No, no, we economize any. Eh, kuda se sabura. Hmm? Then for example here to econo economize the, 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 the definition of economize is to avoid waste or to use freely. Yes. Nuvango no kwi no kwirinda gusesagura. Kwirinda wasting to avoid waste. Stop wasting money. Try to economize. We say to economize. Urumba stress the hana. Nuzo njero kuvuga ngoti economize economize no we say to economize economize good to avoid waste uh, to use frugally no kidding that the sabura chane even for example you can say i'm going to economize my wallet because because of covid 19 ngiye ko economize umufuka wanje wallet iko fiyanje niba najya gankura mu ibumbi bitano muri wallet ngiye kujya nkura mu bibiri you are economizing that time my dear good to economize good Uh, these people are economizing their properties abantu bari kugenda bekonomiza mu byukuri imitungo yabo ntabwo bakigenda bagurisha amasambu yabo ko bashatse to economize good does it make sense very nice ndu visoma muri kuryumva neza then the last word not the least kuko tuzabigisha byinshi kuri ibi is finalize umunye shuri wacu yagerageje ariko avuga finalize no finalize no we say finalize i'm going to finalize the house finalize ni ngokujya ku musozo ndi ku musozo i am finalizing my house nuva ngo icyo giye buri gushiraho utuntu twanyuma ku nzu yawe you are finalizing good then here we are going to count the stress twakubwiye ko icyo utakibara you count this one the second stress then the the third one which is five then you put the stress here five finalize finalize don't say finalize again tuzongere kuvugira ijambo ngo finalize we are finalizing no we are finalizing that is to finalize to finalize good then to finalize is to finish or to complete or to make final that is to finalize good then for example you can say john is finalizing his work or many people are finalizing their activities that is to finalize to, to, to to complete something that you have started good then the other the, the last uh, the last part of our lesson is a kind of court twaba teguriye court you you must see you are with mother teresa mother teresa wa mwita muri gatulika wa mwita neza teresa we karikuta eh bavuga teresa mutagatifu teresa we karikuta eh mother mother teresa yaravuze ngo do small things with great love do small things with great love ko ri bintu bito bito ariko mu rukundo ruhebuje do small things with great love urumva rakanu kagufi but which is very very nice very fantastic which has the full message which is very great do small things with great love jukoro tuntu dutoya ariko turi mu rukundo kuruta gukora ibintu binini bitari mu rukundo kugira ngo bakubonde oh yeah do small things with great love i am teacher jasper we are together for the next lessons bye bye